In this first technique, you're going to mirror image one of the shapes that you've taken from your building. I have stuck my piece of paper with the shape onto the window and what I'm going to do is just trace onto a new piece of paper my original shape and then I'm going to rotate or flip the piece of paper 180 degrees and then trace it again so that I get a mirror image as you can see here. You could do this vertically so that your pattern is up and down or you can do it horizontally as I'm doing it here. This time I am going to create a, a rotated pattern and with the shape I've got here it actually I've got an idea of putting the points together and making a kind of disc shape so you can see I'm rotating my original one to see how best to go about it and I've gone with it 180 degrees at the moment and then I'm going to do it like a clock either side you can overlap them, which we'll do in another technique as well. Um, but it's just a case of repeating the shape and, and playing with it. You're only seeing me doing this in one scenario here. I might try a number of different placements of that repeat to see what kind of interesting shapes I get. Essentially, the important thing is to enjoy this process and see what happens as you experiment by tracing and repeating the shape that you started with. Here you can see the overlap technique where I've just traced the original starting shape and in the top version I've overlapped and rotated it and the bottom one I've overlapped the shape in a way that suggests the triangle. It's important to note that when you're overlapping you just draw each shape originally as you can see and don't worry about the lines that overlap each other because that creates more shapes that you can then perhaps colour or manipulate further. Here you can see me start again with the original triangular shape. I'm drawing in pencil and I'm trying to keep my lines quite light. This will enable me to erase or remove sections of it as I go along, perhaps further down the line. I might also add some black pen to emphasize sections as well as removing parts but essentially I'm experimenting by overlapping the shapes and drawing each one each repeated shape as if transparent I create new shapes by doing this when the overlap shapes interact with each other you can see me playing around a little bit with the paper and the placement of my new drawing so that I can best 
emphasize that triangular shape in this case. Your shape might be more circular or obviously a different shape altogether. So it's all about experimenting with this overlapping technique to see what you can create. After I have done the original shapes, you can see that I've actually taken a black pen, as I'm doing just now, and actually blocking in areas in both of the ideas to see, again, what else I can create. 